afternoon. My name is Vanessa Rubin, and I am honored to be here to speak about uh, being the recipient of two uh, partial cornea transplants that I received uh, from Eversight. And um, I can't, I hope that I can express uh, how grateful I am and how important this has uh, become to me in my life. Uh, first, I'm a professional jazz singer. And um, I travel a lot. Eyesight is so important when you're traveling. If I'm traveling internationally, I have to read things in the airport, read things in foreign airports, uh, read foreign languages, uh, things like that. You know, eyesight is something I don't think any of us take for granted, but I think it is in that moment when we either lose our sight or have some type of real trouble with our sight that we realize how important it is how critical it is, what a gift it is. Uh, as a singer, I also have to read music. Uh, when I'm at the piano or when I'm trying to play my flute a little bit, uh, I, I, I need my eyesight to see the notes just on the page. Most importantly, when I'm performing, my connection to my audience is so important, being able to see them to look at them, to make that connection with them, and they also with me is so important. Um, another reason why uh, uh, getting my eyesight improved was so important. Um, I'm a substitute teacher too. I'm a former English teacher, uh, but I'm a substitute teacher now. And um, anyone that teaches know how important eyesight is to be able to come in and uh, deliver a lesson and look your students directly in the eye and identify things around the classroom. I'm also a caregiver uh, more and more each day to uh, an elderly relative of mine. So I really need my eyesight to go over and to care for her. Uh, all of us love entertainment. We like to go to the movies. We like to watch things on television. Uh, I like to watch some of my favorite musical videos. So once again, the importance of having my eyesight to be able to participate in those events are so very important. How about just uh, the, the daily things that we do for ourselves? Get a, getting up in the morning and looking into the mirror and seeing our reflection. We do that how many times a day? To comb our hair, to brush our teeth, to dress ourselves, to see how, oh, I'm a shopper. I love to shop. If I didn't have my eyesight, I don't know, maybe I would save more money. <laughs> but I love to go in and try on clothes to see how I look. Uh, uh, I'm, you know, I'm active outside, I'm a gardener. So I love to go out and put my hands in the soil. Uh, to see the different colors in my rock garden each year. I look forward to that. Uh, I love to walk because I love to commune with nature. So when I'm walking, I'm not listening to music in my headphones. I'm meditating. I'm looking at mother nature. I'm looking at the trees. I'm taking in all the sights. These are all the things that happen with sight. And um, being a recipient of these two DMEC uh, procedures uh, done at the Cole Clinic uh, have been two of the greatest blessings that I have had, especially during this time of COVID, where so many things have been taken away from people. Uh, the isolation that we all have from each other. Uh, I'm able to receive these uh, two procedures and this gift of, an, of, of, of um, improving my eyesight and having some of the greatest doctors in the world do it for me. Uh, it's just been such a blessing. And um, 
I want to be a part of the effort in spreading the good word as much as possible to anyone who is afraid to have it done or whatever, just go right ahead. It is a wonderful thing. And so hopefully you'll see me again. Thank you.